It's Gloria and you are watching Tinker Wonderland. On today's video, we have another episode of Redeem, Restore, Repurpose. Yes, guys. This is another uh, trip flip video that I, uh, that I will share with you. And uh, I am going to use these blocks. So, again, if you guys uh, remember, I love thrifting. I get uh, a very nice items from the thrift store that we uh, we have here in our place. And uh, I got, this is one of the items that I got from the thrift store. And I, um, I got it for 25 cents. So here, right here. <laughs> so here's the price. So yeah, I got this one for 25 cents at our thrift store here in Iowa and yes guys i am going to like i said i am going to trip uh flip this as a home decor so if you guys want to see how i made this block into a beautiful home decor just keep watching and i hope you enjoy what you will enjoy watching this video if you are new to me to this channel i would love to have you as part of our youtube family consider to click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell button so you won't miss any of our video i have variety of videos here on my channel so i hope you will uh, check it out and consider to subscribe if you are my current subscriber thank you thank you thank you so much for your love and support since day one thank you for staying with me and uh, here we go let's move on and i will show you how i make this so here you go guys and here is some of the materials that i will be using here in this project like I said, we have we're going to use these blocks that I am that I uh, redeem from a trip store for twenty five cents. So this is a solid block, and then I will be using this uh, Waverly paint uh, in a maize color. It's an acrylic paint, matte finish. And then we'll also be using this white apple barrel paint and also white matte, matte acrylic paint in matte i've been telling i've been saying matte i'm i will also be using this uh, wood glue and a glue a uh, hot glue in a glue gun so we have two different types of glue here so and then i will also be using this uh wooden b that i uh, bought from hobby lobby this is these are the bees that i got Again, from Hobby Lobby, we have this one. We have this another bee. <laughs> Isn't that cute, guys? And then this one, this bee in a hunt with honey and a flower. So, yeah. I might also be using um, some stickers or um, a stencil to uh, do some of the wordings and these blocks. So... Let's move on and I will show you how I am going to do this. Just keep watching. I decided to use this uh, foam brush to uh, paint this block with this white apple barrel uh, paint, acrylic paint. And uh, just uh, pour, I will just going to pour this uh, paint here and just keep it rub rub. <laughs> keep a rub on this uh, block. And I will just uh, basically uh, cover all this whole block with this white paint. And uh, I am planning to alternate the yellow and the white for this block. But for now, I uh, uh, basically will just paint this whole thing with block. And later on, I will alternate it, the black and uh, the white and the yellow color of the for the paint. So here you go. Here is the first coating for my uh, block with the acrylic white acrylic paint apple barrel. So uh, now that the paint, uh, the white paint is dry, the next thing I'm going to do is to paint both two sides of yellow. So here is my Waverly um, paint in maize color. It's still unopened, so I have to uh, <laughs> to uh, remove this uh, foil up here. 
so i hope you guys still in the good good day <laughs> still having a good day today and um so here we go guys so i'm just gonna put, uh, open this one and like i said i am going to uh, paint use this same i'm gonna use the same brush or uh, yeah the same foam brush and i am going to paint this side with yellow so i'm just gonna pour some of this paint right here just a little bit So as you as you can see i also put put the uh, tape on this side so it won't uh, go all over the other side the yellow so it covers the white on that area and just like that and i will do this the same I will do the same thing on the other side for the yellow one. I apologize for that noise. <laughs> Somebody just texted me. Okay, so there you go. There you go guys so there's the first yellow on this side so i decided to just uh do one coat of paint i don't mind that because i also want to distress it just the way it is and also yellow on this other side so how you guys been doing today i hope everybody is doing okay this is just a simple uh trip flip that i decided to do since i uh, got this um this block here i've been thinking of things that uh what i can do with this one so i decided well, I actually got an inspiration from Hobby Lobby when I uh, saw their uh, um, some of their decor there. And I thought of, uh, that's why I thought of doing this. I think it's just, it's not the same uh, blocks that I saw at Hobby Lobby. But uh, I just thought of these blocks and uh, I uh, realized I can also do that uh, kind of decor with this kind of block so that's how i did so there you go i have the two yellow on both sides so it's going to be alternate yellow white yellow and another white right there so i will just let this dry and uh, we'll go on the next um steps for this video so the next thing i did is just i uh trace these letters uh, with the pencil and uh, trace all these letters here in the blocks and I am just going to uh, fill it with black marker here is how it turns out when I uh, use the markers on those letters so there is you beautiful kind happy and humble now before i put all these bees here on top of our um, blocks i did i decided to put the some of this uh, one of this succulent plant that i also got from dollar tree so i'm going to stick it in so I'm cutting, just cutting uh, some the stems. Trying to make it smaller, guys. So 
So I'm just cutting this stem shorter so it will fit on my uh, small um, butt here. So just like that. And then I will just add some of the leaves here from this flower. So it's going to look prettier. So maybe it's going to it's going to look better than without the leaves on. <laughs> so just like that stick it in and here oh, I better put some of the glue on the bottom because it's wig it wiggles so it will stick in the middle and there you go so I'm just gonna add some of this leaves again Just like that I think it looks nice right guys so this is hand like um, on the spot for um, what you call that no editing <laughs> whatever I can think of I will do it on this project so if you notice guys I am just adding all these things I didn't even mention this to the materials that I'm going to use for this project, but it's okay. So here you go. So I have this pot now. So that's, that will look like that. So pretty. I love succulents though. And then I will stick it here on top of our blocks. I should better, I won't take off. Um, I am trying to remove the uh, tag on the bottom, but it won't take off. So I'm just going to work with it and stick it right in the middle. I am just estimating which one, where is the middle of this um blocks and there you go i am guesstimating guys <laughs> i'm just going to ha add some of the glue on the other on the side of this part to stick it better and just like that there you go now we're ready to um, add all these bees so it's gonna be like that So there you go guys, that's what I've been doing. So I'm just going to add the rest on all sides of our uh, blocks here. Bear me with this because I'm trying to spot the right position for this uh, bees. So that's how it will look like. So
so guys if you like what you are seeing or if you like what you see uh, hit that subscribe button share this video and comment down below what else you would like or if you have any suggestion that uh, you want me to do for the for another another um diy project and i will try to do it for you guys give this video a thumbs up that will help me um do more of a diys like this and like i said guys um subscription is free it's it is totally free you don't have to pay anything so please consider to uh, click that subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell button so you won't miss any of our video we would love to have you as part of our youtube family this part this one is a little hard to uh, stick here so i am having a hard time and so i'm taking a little bit of your time with this one bear me with that <laughs> Okay, if you guys notice, I take off all the bees that I uh, stick earlier, stick on, on top of this earlier. Then um, I decide I uh, decided to add add this um, wooden tower blocks, also from Dollar Tree, uh, and also I add some of this moss on top of this uh, succulent plant, and then like I said, I am going to add this blocks for our bees right here to add more strength so it will stick well on the on top of our block here so the because the one that i've been doing earlier didn't work right so i better uh, stick this blocks it doesn't have any strength to uh, stand up so I am just going to add this one. Okay, again, guys, thank you all for uh, spending some of your time watching this video. I hope at least I am entertaining you and you are getting uh, some of the tips on how to make or how can you um consume some of your time so you want you will not be bored while uh staying at home and so let's just craft <laughs> And here is the other one. Just like that. There you go. And I will just do this on the other bees that is that left here and also i just decided to use this um hot glue because it sticks faster and better than the wood glue that i have right now and so if i uh, mention that materials that i'm going to use for this uh project well i didn't i decided not to use the wood glue And if you guys remember this tray that I uh, also haul from the trip store, that's what I'm using for that. I use my uh, glue gun to um, just like that. 
to uh, catch all those uh, hot glue that is dropping from that glue gun and it's also safer to have it in um, a porcelain tray than uh, leave it on to my desk so there you go that's the third one and we're gonna do the last one so here is our last B I'm gonna just I'm just gonna stick this here And like I said, guys, I hope you are liking this video. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Share, comment, and subscribe on this channel, Tinker Wonderland. Uh, to my uh, Filipino, all Filipino subscribers, maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong panonood. At kung hindi pa po kayo nakaka-subscribe, subscribe na po kayo sa aming channel, Tinker Wonderland. Uh, libre po ang pag-subscribe guys uh, that's the only way na uh, to support my channel para po uh, makapanood din kayo ng, uh, maram ng iba't ibang video na, na aking na-upload dito sa channel nito at uh, yes, don't forget po na i-click rin po ninyo ang uh, bell button na makikita ninyo dyan sa baba sa tabi ng subscribe button para Hindi po ninyo ma-miss ang mga video na ina-upload ko every day. Yes, every day po. I have um uh, different kinds of videos every day. I am trying to upload different videos, variety of videos so you uh, won't get bored on our channel. Para naman po hindi kayo ma-bored. Check nyo po ang aming content so and I hope um I hope ma-enjoy po ninyo ang uh, content ng aming video or ng aming channel para and uh, mag-subscribe na rin po kayo. <laughs> so, there you go. So, there you go, guys. <laughs> so, I am now trying to uh, stick all this um, or glue all this bees right here and my um, blocks I am trying to estimate first which one is better on the on each side So, I hope you guys are all doing good. Huwag na po tayong, uh, don't just go out. Try not to go out if you don't need to go out. <laughs> just watch my uh, video. Watch my channel, Tinker Wonderland. So, you will be entertained. <laughs> okay. So, I will start doing or sticking or gluing this uh, bee right here on this side now i'll show it to you and that's how it turns out how cool how cool is that guys isn't that cute <laughs> so far i am liking this uh project and now i'm going to do this side i apologize if i have to turn the cam or the blocks so i can uh, just glue it right here the cam is right in front of me And here's the second one that I just um, glue. So we have be humble and be beautiful. Next, I'm going to put this or stick this one here.
what you guys think about this. Does it turn out good or it turns out nice? Do you guys like it? Don't forget to uh, click that like button if you like this video. And you can uh, put your comment down below. I am open to any suggestion and um, any any comment that you want better either it's good or bad I am open to that don't worry I will not get mad at you <laughs> I need I, I sometimes you also need the critics to uh, our project to what we're doing so uh, for me it helps to uh, do better make your project more beautiful the next time right so yeah i don't mind if you guys give me a, a suggestions negative comments is not always a negative that's gonna be positive for me because i am learning I am learning to all negative um, comments too, guys. But hopefully, it will not be always negative. Because <laughs> I know I'm also doing a better better one <laughs> or a good one. So, there you go, guys. Will it be nice to put more of this? We'll see. So, I will just uh, check if it it's nice to put more of this um, moss right here on the bottom how you guys think if I put more moss on the bottom so I think it be it looks better right with the moss on the bottom of it I finally found this um, what kind of moss is this uh, this reindeer moss at the Dollar Tree. I've been looking for this for a long time. I always find the Spanish moss. <laughs> I hate the Spanish moss, guys. It's like a dust. Just like a dust. And uh, yeah, I love this one. This one is better. So there you go, guys. I finally am finally done with this one. <laughs> so I can move on to the next project. Oh my god, <laughs> look at that, guys. Isn't that nice? Does it, look, does it look better with the moss on the sides? I think so. So, there you go. That is my uh, wooden, my DIY B block project for a uh, uh, project that, oh, decoration for today. A B block decoration for today. So we have be beautiful, be humble, be happy, and be kind. So I hope you guys enjoy watching this video.
is all my uh, DIY home decor for today. I hope you enjoy watching this video. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Share, comment, and subscribe on this channel, Thinker Wonderland. Again, to my current subscriber, thank you all for watching. Thank you all for your love and support since day one. I really, really appreciate you guys. Thank you for staying with me. To my, uh, If you are new to this channel, I would love to have you as part of our YouTube family. Consider to click the subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell button so you won't miss any of our video. To my Filipino subscribers, maraming 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 salamat po sa inyong panonood. Salamat po sa pagtangkilik sa Tinker Wonderland. At uh, kung di pa po kayo nakakasubscribe, subscribe na po kayo sa aking channel, Tinker Wonderland. Uh, salamat po sa inyong pagtangkilik at hanggang sa muli. That's all for now guys. Thank you all for watching. Have a good day and a good night. God bless everyone. Bye bye for now. See you on the next vlog.